After coming all this way, perhaps what's needed is some land of your own inside the park's boundaries. Hmm, sort of a farthing wood within White Deer Park? As long as he's not on my patch. Scarface threatened everything. Frightened the life out of me, he did. And he had this horrible scar on his face. No one is forced to live on farthing land. But if you don't, remember, you won't be protected by the oath. It began to grow colder. Winter was coming. Can't even dig up grubs. <laughs> Remember the oaf. <laughs> that was no farthing wood mouse. Better safe than sorry, Kestrel. Miserable little cheat. Of course, it is more difficult when the pond is frozen over, but on the other hand, fish do tend to be rather sluggish when it's cold, which makes our job easier. So you see, with a little perseverance, we can be as successful in winter as in summer. Though, of course, we must be careful not to stay in one place too long, due to the danger of being frozen in situ. Ooh. My old bones are telling me we're in for a hard winter. Ooh. The warden knows something too. I saw him putting out hay for the deer this morning. That's a bad sign. Well, at least we've got the oath. How's that supposed to help? It won't feed us, will it? No, but it will remind us to look after one another. Well said, Fox. When it comes to survival, it is the fittest who emerge triumphant. But we must look after the old ones, Owl. It is the law of nature. We go against nature at our peril. The fit shall perish with the weak. Take my word for it. Hi there, mateys. Toady, not gone into hibernation yet? <sighs> Just wanted to say goodbye. <sighs> oh dear, I'd better get my head down double quick, or I'll fall asleep in the open. <sighs> Bye, mateys. Bye, Toad. See you in the spring. We hope... Toad's right. Too cold out here in the open. I'm going home. Get my head down. Goodbye, Badger. Poor old Badger. Peace. Toad, not get a bit of sleep around here. Take that, mateys. Hopeless, hopeless. One might as well try and crack shellfish. Oh, my goodness, aren't I the brainy one? Hmm, are you, my dear? Crayfish, how do you like them? Well, I'll eat them if I'm hungry, and I am. Follow me! Hmm. 
No one would have thought the snow would last so long. Be hungry, girl. Oh, a grab. Tar ever so. Mm. Got any more? How rude. You're useless. Mm, wait for me. Nice to see. Someone's eating. Oh, I say, Badger. Do try some. Well, at least it's meat. Want some more? Speedy's got a whole heap of them. You wouldn't. Uh, it, it's fox and vixen, you see. Skin and bone. All the meat eaters. Uh, say no more. Whistler has not forgotten the oath. Take all you can carry, Badger. You're so good at fishing, my dear. You'll soon catch some more. What do you think about the survival of the fitties now, Al? Don't interrupt while I'm eating. <laughs> <laughs> Food! You're not farthing wood! But... But... <laughs> Go away! You've saved our lives, Whistler. What wouldn't I give for one mouse? I couldn't so much as look at another crayfish. Oh, come on. Let's go hunting. My, what miserable-looking specimens they are. At least having their own territory keeps them at a suitable distance from us. I would hate to see our cubs mixing with theirs, wouldn't you? Ah, uh, as long as they stay there. But just let them put one foot wrong. It's as though they were keeping us prisoner. Don't want us poaching on their territory. But they've got most of the park. We'll starve if we keep to farthing land. That was the deal. No use fighting about it now. But look at you. We'll manage. prisoner on our own lands. We can't come on yours, and you can't come on ours. But if we don't, we'll starve. We can't eat farthing wood creatures because of the oath. It leaves us very little. My heart bleeds for you. <laughs> There's one thing you have to learn, my dear. My mate is the law around here. Oh, I thought the stag would... The stag may be the king, but Scarface holds the power. No one can better him. Not even you. Oh, how dare you. Vixen! Thirty, hundred and thirty, one hundred and thirty-two. Oh, it's no good. Whew. May as well go and see how the others are doing. My goodness, what a winter. Never seen the like. Maisley! Maisley! Ooh! King of 
the castle, you're the dirty rascal. for them. I don't know. Where did those nuts come from? Collected them myself, didn't I? Are you sure you didn't steal them from the wet schools? We didn't want any trouble. Me? Steal? Do me a favour. All right. What do you want for them? Nice warm bed for the night? What do you mean, Badger's gone? I looked for him in his set, and he wasn't there. Probably just gone out for a bit. Nothing to worry about. But there's just no trace of him. Oh, no. We were so anxious about getting enough to eat ourselves, we forgot to take care of him. He's old, Fox. All right. I'll call a meeting. Maybe we can send out a search party. we care. We aren't bound by the oath anymore. We all have to look after ourselves now. Badger might die. Ooh. And not before time. What was that? I said, uh, <coughs> I said we all have to go sometime. I might die of cold and starvation. Doesn't anybody care about me? Stop making an exhibition of yourself. The oath doesn't mean anything anymore. I, I quite agree. Look what happened to my wife. Kestrel ate her. Oh, dear. I'll never live it down, will I? Pride comes before a... Stop squabbling and let's get on with it. Are there any volunteers to look for Badger? Remember how he led you all when I was swept away by the river? It's no good looking at us. I know it was our fault you got swept away, but look at me. I'm skin and bone, frozen to the... Shut pack. up. Oh, all right. I'll go. So will I. My eyes should spot him in the snow. Ah! Where's Weasel? She might make herself useful for once. I told you to remember where you left it. I said at the time. But I'm sure it was here somewhere. Always the same. Goes crazy looking for nuts, squirrels them away and then forgets where she put them. I ask you. I was right. It was here. Someone's raided my larder. And I know who. <laughs> oh, what happened? <laughs> what brings you this way, Fox? I'm looking for Badger. He's disappeared. So interesting. This concern your band of animals feels for one another. Is Farthing Land all you hope for? It is, but... I see you're hungry. A pity you don't eat hay, Fox. The Warden leaves plenty for us. Some of the smaller creatures, rabbits, field mice, they'd like some hay. Then they shall have it. I hope you find the badger. Kestrel, have you seen any sign of him? I've searched from one end of the park to the other. He seems to have disappeared. Well... Nothing. 
soul? I've looked high and low. It's very peculiar. I mean, you can't just have vanished into thin air. It's time we all accepted it. Badger is dead. No! No! He isn't dead! He isn't! I won't believe it! his word. At least the grass eaters amongst us won't starve. What's happened to me? Did the man do this to me? Don't you remember what happened? Uh, no. He won't like you doing that. I suppose an enemy hurt you. I haven't got many uh, enemies. Just humans and... Uh... But my human looked after you. You should be thanking your lucky stars. Uh, uh, dogs. Dogs. Now you're talking, disgusting, fawning creatures. Now who's fawning? Don't spit at the badger. There, badger. Try and eat a bit of that. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> there, there, I won't hurt you. I have him eating out of my paw. You mean you eat out of his? You wouldn't survive in the wild for two seconds. I could if I wanted. I keep in practice. And I still hunt for fun. Ah! <laughs> you call that fun? Didn't you like it? <laughs> Please yourself. Uh, and where do you think you're going? Home. You can forget about that. Why? I'm not a prisoner, am I? Keep your fur on. He'll let you go as soon as you can walk, but not before. But my friends will be worried about me. Fox, rabbit, owl, kistrel, hare, toad. What dreadful company you keep. We learn to tolerate one another, even look after one another. We came such a long way together. Mm. This sounds like the start of a good story for a winter afternoon. Kestrel, have you seen Badger yet? Because of the oath, the other animals are bound to help me. If they think I'm in trouble, they won't stop looking for me, even at risk to their own lives. So? I can't walk, but you can. You could take a message to them. Tell them I'm all right. I knew you were after something. Go out in that nasty cold snow. You must be joking. 
If you do, they'll always be your friends. The oath will extend to you, and if ever you're in trouble... I understand. I lick your back. You lick mine. <laughs> Yuck! On the other hand, perhaps it would be easier to take your message. We're going round in circles. Look, poor Moly. He's wearing himself out looking for Badger. We all are. Oh. I'm a fool to myself, really. Did you say badger? Are you the mole from Farthing Wood? Ah, then you are his friend. He sent me with a message. He was injured somehow, but now he's quite safe in the Warden's Lodge. Oh, thank you. Thank you. He'll be there until he's better. All right? Right? It's wonderful! <laughs> I thought you liked the badger. I do. <laughs> I do. Then why are you crying? I just told you, he is all right. That's why I'm crying. <sighs> Inscrutable. I say, I say, I say. Oh, don't say you want me to take a message back as well. Oh, all right. I'm coming. <laughs> That's a friend! Oh, not again! Where's the mouse now? What's going on? I suppose you're vixen. <sighs> you and your stupid oath. <laughs> I can't walk a step 